Wer bist du? Mein Name ist Norbi. I consider myself as a European Hungarian Roma person. I belong to the LGBTQ plus and the Romani minority as well at the same time. Wie würdest du deine Kindheit in einem Wort beschreiben? Amazing. Was ist das Lieblingsessen aus deiner Kindheit? Maybe everything that was made by my grandma. Was ist das Beste am Leben in Ungarn? Being European. Das Schlimmste am Leben in Ungarn? Politics. Und was machst du? I work for the organization as a walking tour coordinator and guide. We have a walking tour that is called Come with us to the Aid District, where we are actually at the moment as well. It offers an opportunity to destroy the harmful stereotypes about the Romani people. Was ist deine Leidenschaft? Being around um, people. I love meeting them. I love talking to them. Warum wissen viele Menschen so wenig über Roma? Every ten person in Hungary could be considered as a Roma person today. However, we are not involved in, in the education and that's ridiculous. If I had a child in Hungary and I wanted to to sh share my culture with them, if I want to introduce my culture, there's, n there's not a single museum where I could bring my child. When it comes to the Holocaust, we talk about the Jewish community, however, other minorities such as the Roma community or the LGBTQ+, are not mentioned at all. Und warum? There are some decision makers who think that They, it is not a must to have these minorities as a part of the of the lectures. Fühlst du dich repräsentiert von diesen Entscheidungsträgern? Not really. Of course, I do not feel represented. These decision makers are mainly not Roma people. Nach welcher Regel lebst du? Just to leave something behind. It's really important for me to create something here in life. It means a lot when I meet people. I just want to inspire them. As they inspire me, I want to give something to them. Welche Klischees gibt es über Roma? Sometimes it's, it's really blended with the word of uh, poverty, for example. They have like fears. Be considered as a minority who steal things from the shops and things like that. Be considered as people who do, do not attend uh, universities. We do not go to high schools. And these kind of stereotypes destroy the whole picture of Romani people. Was war das beste Kompliment, das du je bekommen hast? It was about my open mindset and my open mindness. And uh, it means a lot for me. Welche Superkraft hättest du gerne? Maybe just to see other people's mindsets and thoughts. Schnelle Runde. Morgens oder abends? Evening. Tee oder Kaffee? Tee. Drinnen oder draußen? Inside. Allein oder gemeinsam? Together. Sommer oder Winter? Summer. Süß oder salzig? Salty. Strand oder Berge? Beach. Ungarisch oder Rom? Hungarian Romani. Zukunft oder Vergangenheit? Future. Fauler oder produktiver Sonntag? Productive Sunday. Komödie oder Drama? Drama. Was ist die Geschichte der Roma? We started these whole rendering processes before the common era. The reason is not uh, something that is confirmed, unfortunately, but it could be an inner, inner motivation or a war. And we reached uh, the Caucasus, the Balkan area, Egypt, Central Europe, Scandinavia and West, Western Europe as well, and after that the US. I belong to the first Roma group who came here to Hungary. We are the Romungro. We came here in 1416. We were the victims of a forced assimilation process. We needed to leave our language behind. Actually, at home, we do not speak the Romani language. We do not keep any kind of tradition uh, anymore because of this fact. So I didn't have any kind of opportunity to, to meet the culture itself. Erfährst du Diskriminierung? I experienced discrimination. I'm experiencing discrimination and I will experience discrimination. I was 18 years old when I went into the city central in Mishkoetz with my friends, uh, with my non-Roma friends. And when we wanted to enter the club, the security guard refused to enter us to the, to the area of the club because of my skin color. And they showed us the description of the event And in the description, there's a line, and it is like they have face 
and dress control. We do not know what it means actually, however they refer to that and it protects them not to allow in specific minorities. It's really important for me not to victimize myself because it's not on the Roma community, it's not on the non-Roma community, it's about a communication that doesn't exist at the moment. Was bedeutet Bildung für dich? Everything. Was sollen die Menschen über Roma wissen? I want them to know that our culture is not about poverty, it's not about uh, bad behavior, it's not about undereducated children, it's about more than that, it's about history, it's about the wandering, it's about everything that happened to us. It is about the assimilation, the integration that we survived. I want them to see that we are equal. Worauf bist du stolz? I'm so proud of myself and my family and my friends, my environment. I'm really proud to be a Roma person in Hungary.